COVID-19 rarely kills children. But this evening, a community in southwestern Minnesota is mourning the loss of a first grader. The girl was a student at Parkside Elementary School in Marshall. This morning, a letter to parents said that the child died yesterday as a result of complications from the coronavirus. WCCO's Kate Raddett shares what we know about COVID cases in children and why experts believe they're going up now. Marshall Public Schools Superintendent told WCCO a first grade girl named Weekday died from complications from COVID. State health officials have reported an increase in cases and hospitalizations of children from the virus. One, I think, is uh, COVID fatigue. That's always a big issue right now with people letting down their guard. Um, two is that there is a new variant going around. The more contagious B117 variant is spreading throughout the state. The governor's office said that the child that died did not have underlying health conditions. I felt immediately heartbroken for the parents and the family. Cecilia has a daughter in the district. She wonders if students should go back to distance learning until parents have more information on any potential close contacts in the small town school district. Education, of course, is important, but their lives are more important too. I mean, you don't get them back. You don't get a do over. According to the Marshall School District, 22 students and staff are in quarantine at the elementary school. The superintendent said they are following MDH guidelines and no grades are changing from in person learning at this time. Pediatric pulmonologist for Children's Minnesota Hospital, Dr. Brooke Moore, said that most children who are getting COVID are asymptomatic or have mild to moderate symptoms, but 10% of cases are severe. Governor Tim Wall said Monday, it is simply heartbreaking to hear that COVID-19 has taken the life of someone so young. My thoughts are with the Minnesota family grieving the loss of their beloved child. There is no grief more profound than the loss of family. Kate Raddatz, WCCO 4 News. This is the third child in Minnesota under the age of 18 who has died since the start of the pandemic. Experts say children with health conditions, infants and adolescents tend to be more at risk among youth. 